so let's begin first of all the noun noun is the name of persons animals things places or ideas the ending of a noun in esperanto is o like uh, we will see the example separately person knabo 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 is boy and the boy is a person at the ending of the noun is o knab o knabo animal hundo 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 is dog place lerneyo lerneyo that is school thing tranquilo tranquilo knife and idea joyo joyo that is joy so you can see uh, the all these are types of nouns and uh, I must repeat that uh, all Esperanto nouns end in O. This is uh, the hard and fast rule in Esperanto language. Like knabo, boy, tablo, table, chivalo, horse, pomo, apple. Now we will see the article. Article is uh, important in Esperanto language. The definite article is la, that is there. La viro, the man. La viro. La knabo, the boy. La knabo. La chivalo, la chivalo, the horse. La tablo, the table, la pomo, the apple, la lerneo, the school, la patro, the father. So, la virro, la knabo, la chevalo, la tablo, la pomo, la lerneo, la patro. Uh, La is the definite article that corresponds uh, with the English the. La is used for both singular and plural. Uh, friends in many languages like uh, uh, German, French and um, uh, likewise Spanish language, uh, they are uh, separate um, articles for singular and plural. But uh, in Esperanto language, it is not the case. La pomo, the apple. La pomoye. La pomo is plural, the apples. La chevalo. La chevaloi. La chevaloi. That is like that. And uh, la is used for both male and female. In many languages, like in German, uh, article differs with male and female. Actually, it's the article that tells uh, which noun is male or female. But in Esperanto, it is not the case. La patro. La patrino, the father, the mother. La filo, the son. La filino, the daughter. Uh, we should uh, remember uh, the nouns or the words we are going to we have so far learned you should remember them la patro la patrino la filino la filo father mother son and daughter and what about the indefinite article english has an indefinite article a n for the singular but none for the plural esperanto has no indefinite article so knabo may mean Boy, a boy. Pomo, apple, an apple. Same. Birdo, bird, a bird. Floro, flower, a flower. In Esperanto, this is not the distinction. 
Now the adjectives. The ending of adjectives in Esperanto is a. A. This is hard and fast rule. La flava floro. La flava floro. Flava is uh, adjective. La is article and floro is noun. The yellow flower. La bella birdo. La bella birdo. The beautiful bird. La grande cevalo. La grande cevalo. The big horse. La ruzza pomo. La ruzza pomo. The red apple. La bella birdo. La ruzza pomo. La flava floro. La grande cevalo. Bella, flava, ruzza, granda. All are uh, adjectives and end in a. It's not all over. The video is uh, incomplete and uh, you can take the whole course from Udemy. The link is given below. And don't forget to subscribe our channel and share and like the video. Take care. Bye. Keep learning. Keep watching.